embark on a celestial voyage around the Milky Way, our galactic home. This is not just a journey through space, but also through time, as we traverse billions of years to explore the birth and evolution of our galaxy. Our voyage will take us deep into the heart of the Milky Way, where a supermassive black hole churns amidst a dazzling array of stars. We'll journey through the spiral arms, the birthplaces of stars, where gas and dust coalesce into brilliant celestial bodies. We will delve into the mysteries of dark matter, the invisible force guiding the galaxy's rotation and structure. The journey will also explore the potential for life in the galaxy, from the multitude of exoplanets to the tantalizing search for extraterrestrial intelligence. And we will zoom out to meet our galactic neighbors in the cosmic neighborhood. Prepare to journey through billions of stars, vast nebulae, and enigmatic phenomena. At the heart of the Milky Way lies a bustling hub of stellar activity. An area teeming with celestial wonders, the galactic core is the beating heart of our galaxy. Here, millions of stars like bright city lights in the vast cosmic night gather together, forming dense clusters that create a spectacle of unparalleled beauty. In the midst of this stellar metropolis, an entity of unimaginable proportions resides. This is the supermassive black hole known as Sagittarius A asterisk. With a mass equivalent to 4 million suns, this cosmic titan exerts a gravitational pull so immense that it shapes the galaxy around it and holds it together. Sagittarius A plays a crucial role in the life of our galaxy. Black holes, especially supermassive ones like Sagittarius A asterisk, are not just cosmic vacuum cleaners sucking in everything that comes too close. They are also the ultimate cosmic recyclers. When a star ventures too close, it is torn apart by the black hole's gravity in a process called spaghettification. The remnants of the star are then shot out into the galaxy, providing the raw materials for new stars, planets, and potentially, life. The galactic core, with its dense star clusters and dominating black hole, is more than just a region of space. It's the engine room of our galaxy, driving its rotation and influencing its structure. It's a testament to the power and beauty of the cosmos, a place where creation and destruction occur on a truly grand scale. And at the very center, anchoring this swirling mass of stars and gas is Sagittarius A asterisk, a supermassive black hole that, while shrouded in mystery, binds our galaxy together. The galaxy's spiral arms resplendent with gas and dust are the birthplaces of stars. These celestial cradles swirling majestically around the galactic center are the stage for a cosmic ballet of creation and destruction. Now you might be wondering, how exactly do stars form in these spiral arms? Well, it all begins with clouds of gas and dust known as nebulae. As these nebulae are pulled together by gravity, they become denser and hotter, eventually igniting to form a new star. It's an awe-inspiring process that takes millions of years and results in an object so bright and energetic it can be seen across the galaxy. But just as stars are born, they also die. Depending on their mass, stars end their lives in spectacular supernova, or fade away as white dwarfs. These events are not just the end of a star's life, but also a beginning. The remnants left behind by a supernova, for instance, can form the building blocks for new stars, planets, and even life. So, the spiral arms are not just static structures in our galaxy. They're dynamic, constantly changing, and full of activity. They're a testament to the cyclical nature of the universe, where death gives way to new life, and the cycle continues. Furthermore, these spiral arms are not evenly spaced or identical. Each has its own characteristics, its own collection of stars, nebulae, and other celestial objects. Some arms are bustling with star formation while others are quieter with older stars calmly going about their cosmic dance. The spiral arms of our Milky Way are a testament to the galaxy's vibrant, ever-changing nature. They're a reflection of the universe's grand scale, its complexity, and its enduring cycle of creation and destruction. So. The next time you look up at the night sky, remember, you're not just seeing stars. You're witnessing the birth, life, and death of these celestial bodies playing out across the eons. These nurseries weave a tale of creation and destruction within the cosmic dance. Invisible yet powerful, dark matter envelops the Milky Way. It's a cosmic enigma, a ghost of the cosmos that we cannot see or touch, yet its gravitational influence is undeniable. Dark matter is a term coined by scientists to describe a form of matter that, while we cannot directly observe it, seems to make up around 85% of the universe's total matter. The name dark doesn't imply it's some sort of shadowy or evil substance. 
Rather, it simply means that it does not interact with light or other forms of electromagnetic radiation. Therefore, it's invisible to our current methods of detection. So, how do we know it's there? Good question. The existence of dark matter is inferred from its gravitational effects on visible matter, radiation, and the large-scale structure of the universe. For instance, the stars at the edges of galaxies, including our own Milky Way, move at speeds that should send them flying into space, according to the laws of physics. But they don't. Something unseen seems to be holding them in place. That something is what we call dark matter. But here's the kicker. We don't know what dark matter is made of. It's one of the most pressing conundrums in modern physics. Is it made of undiscovered subatomic particles? Or is it something entirely different? Something that challenges our fundamental understanding of the universe? Dark matter is a cosmic puzzle, a mystery wrapped in the fabric of space and time. It's a reminder that there's so much about the universe that we don't know. Yet its elusive nature doesn't deter us. On the contrary, it drives our curiosity our desire to explore and understand. In the grand cosmic theater, dark matter plays a crucial role. It's the unseen stagehand that sets the scene, guiding the structure and rotation of galaxies, including our majestic Milky Way. This mysterious substance challenges our understanding of the universe. Yet, in that challenge, we find the thrill of exploration, the joy of discovery, and the endless potential of human ingenuity. Our galaxy teems with planets, each a world unto itself. From rocky barren wastelands to gas giants larger than our own Jupiter, the Milky Way is a cosmic zoo, home to a dizzying array of celestial bodies. But among these countless planets, a special category captures our attention. Exoplanets. These are planets that orbit stars outside our solar system. With the help of space telescopes like Kepler and TESS, we have been able to identify more than 4,000 of these exoplanets. Each discovery brings us one step closer to answering that timeless question. Are we alone in the universe? We've found exoplanets in the Goldilocks zone, where conditions may just be right, not too hot, not too cold, for liquid water to exist. And where there's water, there could be life. Planets such as Proxima Centauri b and Trappist-1e are tantalizing prospects in our search for life beyond Earth. And let's not forget about the moons. Some moons in our solar system like Jupiter's icy Europa and Saturn's geologically active Enceladus, harbor vast oceans beneath their frozen surfaces. These celestial bodies present another intriguing possibility for extraterrestrial life. But the search for life isn't just about finding the right conditions. It's also about listening. Projects like SETI, the search for extraterrestrial intelligence, use radio telescopes to scan the cosmos, hoping to detect signals that could indicate the presence of intelligent life. While we've yet to hear a cosmic hello, the search continues. This quest for life isn't just a scientific endeavor, it's a journey of the human spirit, a testament to our innate curiosity and our longing to understand our place in the cosmos. As we peer into the depths of the Milky Way, we are reminded of the words of astronomer Carl Sagan, who said, The universe is a pretty big place. If it's just us, seems like an awful waste of space. In this vast expanse, the quest for life beyond Earth continues to captivate our imagination. The Milky Way is not alone in the cosmos. This spiral galaxy, our cosmic abode, is part of a much larger and bustling neighborhood. Akin to how our Earth is part of the solar system, the Milky Way is part of a group known as the Local Group. Picture our galaxy as a house in a small town, with other houses scattered around, each representing a different galaxy. Some of these houses or galaxies are relatively close, while others are farther away. This town, in a cosmic sense, is the local group. Now let's meet some of our closest neighbors. The most notable one is the Andromeda Galaxy. It's a spiral galaxy like the Milky Way, but it's considerably larger. It's also on a collision course with our galaxy. But don't worry, this cosmic dance won't begin for another 4 billion years or so. Aside from Andromeda, the Milky Way also has a few smaller companions, the satellite galaxies. These include the large and small Magellanic Clouds, visible from the Southern Hemisphere. They're irregular in shape and much smaller than the Milky Way, yet they orbit around our galaxy in a cosmic ballet. Our local group is just one small part of a much larger structure, the Virgo Supercluster, which contains thousands of galaxies. And even beyond that lies the observable universe, with structures so vast and numerous that they boggle the mind. In the grand scheme of things, 
Our Milky Way is just one of countless galaxies, each with their own unique properties, structures, and histories. Yet, it's our galaxy, our home in the cosmos, that gives us a unique perspective to understand and appreciate the universe's vastness. Surrounded by satellite galaxies and part of the local group, the Milky Way resides in a dynamic cosmic neighborhood. Our journey around the Milky Way is not just about exploring our galaxy, but also about understanding our place in the universe. As we gaze upon the Milky Way from our unique vantage point on Earth, we are presented with a humbling spectacle, a glittering testament to the grandeur of the cosmos. Our galaxy, with its hundred billion stars and vast spiral arms, is but a single entity within an inconceivably large universe. Beyond the confines of the Milky Way there exists a cosmic tapestry woven with galaxies of every shape and size. Some are solitary, others gravitate towards each other, forming colossal structures known as galaxy clusters. These clusters, in turn, connect to form even larger cosmic webs, creating a grand, interconnected universe. Our Milky Way is part of the local group, a cluster of around 54 galaxies, spread over a 10 million light-year expanse. This local group is a small part of the Virgo supercluster, which itself is an even tinier part of the Laniakea supercluster, home to hundreds of thousands of galaxies. And yet, amidst this vast cosmic canvas, here we are, on a small planet orbiting an average star in the outskirts of the Milky Way. It's easy to feel insignificant in the face of such enormity. But consider this, we, the product of billions of years of cosmic evolution, have developed the ability to ask questions, to observe, to understand, and to marvel at the universe we inhabit. Our curiosity has led us to probe the depths of space, to understand our galaxy better, and to ponder our place within it. We have sought to decipher the mysteries of the cosmos, from the enigma of dark matter to the search for extraterrestrial life. As we continue our cosmic journey, let's not forget that we are the universe's way of understanding itself. Our capacity for knowledge, our thirst for discovery, and our relentless pursuit of truth underscore our significance in this vast cosmos. We are reminded of our small yet significant place in the cosmos. Thank you for joining us on this journey around the Milky Way. We ventured through the cosmic expanse, from the bustling hub of the galactic core to the serene spirals of star formation. We've delved into the enigmatic mysteries of dark matter and pondered the potential for life beyond our own blue planet We've explored the awe-inspiring beauty of our cosmic neighborhood, the Milky Way, a galaxy of billions of stars, each with their own tales of creation and destruction. We've glimpsed into the heart of our galaxy, where the supermassive black hole Sagittarius A asterisk holds sway, binding stars, gas, and dust in a cosmic dance that spans billions of years. We've pondered the invisible yet powerful force of dark matter, a mysterious substance that shapes our galaxy and challenges our understanding of the universe. We've considered the potential for life to exist beyond Earth, a quest that captivates us and drives us to explore the unknown corners of our galaxy. We've also looked beyond the boundaries of our galaxy to our cosmic neighbors, the Andromeda Galaxy, the Magellanic Clouds, and the numerous satellite galaxies that form part of our local group. Each of these celestial bodies adds to the rich tapestry of our universe, offering new perspectives and insights into our place in the cosmos. As we gaze upon the Milky Way from our unique vantage point on Earth, we are reminded of our small yet significant place within this vast cosmic expanse. Our journey around the Milky Way is far from over. There are still countless stars to explore, phenomena to understand, and questions to answer. So, let's continue to look up at the night sky, to wonder at the beauty of the cosmos, and to seek answers to the mysteries that lie beyond our reach. Our journey around the Milky Way is a journey of discovery, a journey that can inspire us, challenge us, and remind us of the beauty and mystery of the universe we inhabit. Keep looking up, keep wondering, and continue the journey of discovery.